Yeah. Okay, I'm going to have to devote my full attention to this. Probably. This is Gloomy Gem Grotto. It's dark. Dark is almost never a good decision in an action game. I can live with it. I've already told you that whenever there's like a brightness setting, I always pretty much ignore it. Or I intentionally set it higher than it wants me to. And this is part of it. You're not really getting anything except annoyed by needing light to see around here. And if you fall in a hole, that is it. Although, the fact... I really wish the early use of the reptile roll made it more apparent that... Oh, crud. That you don't need to be moving the whole time. See how much... How far back I have to go? This is going to be a long video no matter how much I chop it up. I didn't get my stupid light. Wow, I'm bad. Super bad at video games, folks. That is I. <sighs> Knowing or having a more intuitive feel that the reptile roll will let... Don't know what to say, folks. I am already so sick of Gloomy Jim Grotto. The reptile roll is such a good example of a mechanic that needs better explaining. It's a little floaty and being on this ice sure doesn't help. But like if you know how slow you can go and still get I am in the hole Jesus okay I finally made it to the midway point I don't know why I'm even trying to get the quills I'm not going to get any of the 200 quill jiggies I don't think so I could have totally saved myself a lot by not trying to gather them but whatever but yeah, the darkness is just obnoxious. The reptile roll is not really adequately... I don't want to call it a tutorial. Because, like... It should have been introduced in such a way... That it's more intuitive that you can just completely stop and control yourself better. Where? Oh, jeez. I'm supposed to be going this way, aren't I? Wait, no, that's where I came from. This is why dark is bad, guys. And we go back to the start now. Do you know what I'm excited for? I'm excited for Rusty Bucket Bay, because I can't imagine it being worse than this. Okay, come to a complete stop. Go to the next one. This is a lot easier when... Oh! I'll do Gloomy Jim Grotto. It being that hard is just a meme. It can't possibly take me 40 minutes. I did not say that last thing, because strictly speaking, it's not true. But that's how long this video is. And it's gonna be... A lot of editing. Oh, it's one of these guys that you can see barely anywhere. Hi. I, I don't like you. If you knock me off, I am probably just going to break down and cry. Of all the things that could have happened in this series to break me, I didn't expect it to be Gloomy Jim Grotto. I didn't remember it being that hard, but apparently I blocked that memory for good reason. Eat the butterfly, Yuka! Okay, do not screw up the easy platforming, for the love of God. I have screwed up the easy platforming. There is no God. 
Okay. I got it this time. There's nothing to worry about. Surely. Surely. Surely this is nearly it. Is there... There is one last horrible stretch, isn't there? We are going to go as slowly as is feasible? Okay. I thought I could see the pagey. What I saw was a quill. Oh. I may wind up making this debacle its own separate video. Why am I picking up quills? I don't need quills. I'm risking everything. This one pagey. I can't keep recording, folks. I don't know if this is the end of episode 14, or its own separate thing, or what, but that was gloomy, 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 gloom, gloom, grotto hole. Thank you for watching.